This is an about face for state rep Todd Corser. He's gone from avoiding the media to now talking to anyone who will listen up here in Lansing. And the people who matter the most are his fellow Republican state representatives. They're not listening to him at all. More on that in a second. Corser tells me he will not resign unless the people in his district in Lapeer want him gone. What would it take for them to send you the message that you need to resign? Well, I think How we'll, resounding does that need to be? Well, I think we'll have those conversations as we go forward. I can't really tell you in regards to that. So I just wanted to give you guys a few minutes. Everybody's been kind of chasing me around. I felt like, you know, this is, uh, you know, and when I came out here, obviously it was, um, you know, seeing all the cameras. And I thought, oh my goodness. And check it out, only seven Action News cameras are rolling as the other half of this scandal. State Rep Cindy Gamrat is asked by House Democratic leader Tim Grimal to apologize to his caucus. She said no and gave him only a letter of apology. Gamrat says she's not resigning and will not be found guilty of misconduct or any crime. Corser spent much of his morning in the gallery above the House floor. He says with family, including his parents, he says, for him, it's business as usual, and he's a no vote on any tax increase to fix the roads. But get this, as we were talking, his Republican colleagues were in caucus discussing the roads. Gamrat and Corser booted out. The Republican caucus is going on right now. You're not in there. I'm not, yeah. Right. Is that, is that awkward for you? No, no, it, it's not. Um, is in, it awkward for you to be here today, given everything that's happened? No, I mean, obviously there's some issues with the, uh, the, the surrounding allegations in regards to myself and the call for censure. Uh, obviously, we have to take a look at those, and, and I'll be responding to those issues uh, as we go forward. But How do you respond to people who say, you should resign, sir? Well, I think everybody's going to have their opinion. I think that's for the voters in my district to decide. I think that they're going to have their, you know, that's going to be a conversation that we'll, we'll have to have. Now, we are not done with State Rep Todd Corser. Coming up next hour at 5, we're going to get into all of the investigations going on with him, the House, the State, and the Feds, and what he did with this elaborate cover-up of his affair with State Rep Cindy Gamrat. We'll see you in an hour. For now, I'm live in Lansing, Jim Kurtzner, the Now Detroit.